Hey, welcome back to the Outdoor Workshop. Today we're gonna to take a look at six instant coffee brands that you may be packing with you whether you're on the trail or traveling abroad. We're gonna take a look at the price points, where you can find them, and wrap it up with a taste testing with some friends. Let's dive into it. The six brands that we're gonna be taking a look at are Folgers Noir, Death Wish Coffee Company, Steeped Coffee Bags, Black Rifle Coffee, Starbucks Via Instant Colombian, and Nescafe's Taster's Choice. These are all generally the medium blends of coffee so they can be compared side by side in our blind taste testing. Let's take a closer look at some of the details of each. Folgers Noir Golden Dust costs $2 for six packets, which leads to 33 cents a packet. You just add six ounces of water and this is a medium to dark roast. Death Wish Coffee is $12 for 8 packets, that's $1.50 a packet. You add 8 ounces of water and they claim to be the world's strongest coffee. It's organic and it's an instant blend with green bean coffee extract. The Steeped Coffee comes in at $5.50 for 5 packets, that's $1.10 per packet. Each packet is a nitro sealed tea bag and you add 8 ounces of water, dunk for 15 to 30 seconds and let sit for 5 minutes. This is a California blend. Black Rifle Coffee Company's Instant Coffee is $30 for 32 packets. It's 94 cents a packet. You add 6 to 8 ounces of water. This is a Colombian coffee, and they're recognized for being a veteran-owned business. Next up is Starbucks Via at $6.50 for 8 packets. That's 81 cents a packet. You just add 8 ounces of water, and this is a Colombia mix. Taster's Choice is by far the cheapest option here. It's $5.25 for 18 packets, and that's 29 cents a packet. Just add 8 ounces of water to their house blend. For all of these, you can adjust the amount of water you use if you prefer your coffee to be stronger or weaker. Now let's move on to taste testing. Here's the reveal of which coffee lines up with which letters. Let's see how each person rated them. Each person labeled the coffee number one for their favorite and number six for their least favorite. As one ranks the highest like a golf score, the lowest total score wins. Black Rifle Coffee came in first, followed by Death Wish Coffee. Starbucks came in third, with Folgers coming in fourth, Taster's Choice with fifth, and the Steeped Coffee came in last. Here are some descriptions that people used to describe the coffees once they were done with the taste test. Thanks again for checking out the Outdoor Workshop. Make sure you like and subscribe. There's links in the description below if you're interested in purchasing. Leave a comment if you have a brand that we left out here that you want us to try. We look forward to seeing you on the next one.